Hi, everybody. Hi. Getting this time. Okay. Um, <laughs> we're back in Philadria, where we last left off our faded heroes. Managed to acquire some new members to their parties. Gathered information on where to find a potential host for the spirit of fear. And yeah, it's, they're on the road. They're heading towards the Iron Mountains because they decided to go the way of the mountain to get to Orin. And um, they just left Anarik. On the road. Yep, you're on the road headed towards Kaza. Keza. Keza is the first stop along the way towards the Iron Mountain entrance. I think we have our pairs. <laughs> <laughs> of course the evil people are sticking together. <laughs> the new members to the parties. Yes. Aside from Keyleth and Conry, who you all met in the first two episodes in their entirety, um, are, it's Kaimana. He joined the party. Tana was told to join the party at the Temple of Farquhar by Marwin, who's the priest. Um, <laughs> so, he figured, what the hey? I was told there was I, fun to be had. Marwin promised him fun. And with Kaimana, you never know what kind of fun that could be. <laughs> I feel like this is like a delayed acknowledgement to people, but most of our campaigns are LBGTQ friendly. So, yep. if you get offended, bye. Yep, um, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> we love everyone. A lot of us can be polyamorous. With polyamorous we are. Oh, I'm sorry. With pansexuality. Oh! Like the ducks. <laughs> like the ducks. Critical role reference, Celine. Damn it. I had to hurry up and catch up. 18 days. Good luck. <laughs> hey. 18 long, glorious days of vax in person. <gasps> Just means I wouldn't be here with y'all. Fuck that, we'll watch together. <laughs> anyway. Yep, anyway. Saladria, not Alexandria. We need to fangirl over Saladria stuff. Joven. They picked up Joven. Easiest person to get them to fangirl over. Um, Joven. He's adorable. He is a ward of the Temple of Ankaras, just like Serenity. They both were allowed to venture out as their kind of coming of age quest. Um, Serenity was raised by the priest of the Temple of Ankaras himself, who they love just as much as Joven. His name was his name was Father Yosef. And then they picked up Zayn, who followed them from the nefarious pantheon because the devil god himself wants to be able to find out what's happening to fear Zeon is a follower of Zephyrot not terrified of but really wanted to be yeah the one with the torture and the fire and the chains 
Yep. Tremont needed an evil buddy, right? <laughs> Can't be the only evil person in the party. I had already rolled these people. I know. And then I asked Becca, who would you like to see as your NPC from the <laughs> Nefarious? And she's like, not the creepy one from that temple. Well, I mean, if I could have my pick, it would have been Marwin. No priest. I know. <coughs> but that's just one voice in your head. That's two voices, but yes. Marwin is special, sweet. I mean, Kaimana was visiting him for a reason. <laughs> anyway, they're, they're on the road heading to Kaza now. I would give you a little information and backstory. Um, I don't reckon they'll actually be too talkative at first, considering how repressed some of the characters are and how shy some of the others are. But let's see what happens. Because it's a long road. Yeah. So which temple are you from? Who's talking to who, Becca? That was Kaimana. That was my guy voice. Z Zaharat. Oh, fun. You have no idea. I don't want to like having you tag along. Tag along, darling. I'm not a tag along. I am the party. I forget I can control everybody. <laughs> Do it! I did that just so I can control those. Damn it. They're not quite at the right length apart. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Serenity. Okay, that'll work. <laughs> Grabs her characters back. <laughs> There we go. So what's the deal with you two? Tasty. Can I just share? Which one is he talking to? <laughs> That's Keel's res response. <laughs> to move to the other side of Conby. <laughs> oh, get over yourself. I'm only here to help. Not so sure I believe that. If helping you means I get to kill things, then I'm only here to help. You try to stop me from killing things, and well, then they'll get really interesting. I'm here to do the things you wouldn't dream of doing in your worst nightmares. Ah, Skittles! <laughs> Way to ruin a dark moment, Danny. <laughs> I dropped my Skittle, I'm sorry. <laughs> Leave it to Danny. <laughs> what, what in the world? What is going on? <laughs> He's 
trying to freak Helix out, which he's succeeding at. I might not be able to terrify you right now, but I can make you increasingly uncomfortable. Seems like a waste of time. No. It's actually quite amusing. Once we find fear, I'm going to play with you. Why couldn't he have sent the eel? <laughs> I think he and your brother would get along a little too well. Yes. Because, Keyleth, you need to grow. Hi, Dad. Oh, yeah, her dad's a scion who has telepathy off the wazooie. <laughs> yeah, he could pretty much hear. Anything. And they're still relatively close to Frostville while he's the strongest. So he has more of a reach. Once they get past the Iron Mountains, it won't work as well. Also, Danny, what is Harold doing in your head? He's fine. He's an NPC, dear Becca. My. Uh huh. I'm doing him so well. Crazy on purpose. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> probably visiting Harper. That is probably true. <laughs> anyway. Anyway, you got a message from your father. Yep. Are you right? I'm fine. Yes, Celine. You're a failure as a guard, you know that, right? You haven't hurt her. I don't think you could stop me if I wanted to. Prove it. What's going on? He was talking to Conry and you totally just blanked again. What? Like I said, Conry still relatively new in my head. He was like the second character you had. I haven't played him in a long time, too. Guess what? I've never played before. in a long time. Kiki. Because <laughs> her sisters long. keep jumping ahead of her in line.
They're boring. They're good, what do you expect? A little fight back. Not all good people are pushovers. Some of them have backbones. Have you ever met Brighton? Can't say that I have. <laughs> They're fun to play with. Hi. Hi. You didn't hear voices in my head? Nope. So, Serenity, Joven, you all gonna talk? Yeah, Joven, no, I know you're not gonna talk unless you're spoken to. Alright. <laughs> He's just watching everything that's happening, taking in everybody's demeanors, and generally just trying to stay in between Serenity and Serenity. Trying <laughs> to stay near Serenity. <laughs> Not really comfortable with anybody aside from his sister from the church. <laughs> yeah. I thought he was okay with Connery. Eh. Ish. Connery's not as scary Ish. as the tiefling lady. Or the scary evil people. Yep. <laughs> So, Serenity, you gonna she... speak? Or are you just gonna tell us what you're doing? She's trying to keep an eye on what's happening between the other four. She's just like not really sure if that's normal. Well, probably knows it's probably not. But what are you doing? What? I just wanted to say hello. Well, saying hello does not mean you get into someone's personal space. It's hard not to get into a gnome's personal space to do something. They're so small and delicate. He has a fair point cool. there. Well, he could have said hello while he was approaching and stopped a good distance back. <laughs> There's the fun in that. But hello to you. Hello, now please get back. <laughs> Wonder if I don't want to. What are you going to do to me? There's always the option to walk around you if you refuse to move. If you think it's an option. Do you think you can get around me? I can certainly try. Oh, do try. One of my computer froze. <laughs> Don't try right now. <laughs> <laughs> All right, anyway. So she's trying to get around him. This sword comes right out at her neck and just, just kind of cuts her path off. Now, now. He just grins. Grabs Joven's hand and walks. Or it's the other half of their party. <laughs> I'm going to be bored so easily. So he just looks back to Joven, like, are you okay? 
He's humming. No, <laughs> Danny was sorry. <laughs> We're gonna switch maps here in a second. All right. Hey, Serenity actually stood up to him. <laughs> kind of. I love that. Kind of. She tried. <laughs> she tried. <clears throat> she did better than Keyleth, who went to run behind Connery, who said, like, nothing. Ooh, drama. Let him have it, Kiki. <laughs> hey, this is my map, too. <laughs> Hush, you. You gave them to me to use. They're all my maps, except for the ones that she hand draws. <laughs> They're not. Some of them might get off Pinterest. By the way, thank you all the Pinterest people for the Pinterest maps. <laughs> if they're your maps, thank you. Hi. If you don't want us to use this, then please let us know. We'll, we'll, we really like using them. Thanks. <laughs> yes. Hi. Trying not to have the murder just run for the water. <laughs> you know he wants to. So is Kiki going to talk to Connery about his lack of doing his job? Not currently. She's too busy watching people. What's the fun in that? <coughs> oh, that's not the one I want. <coughs> Trying to separate NPC cards from other cards. Ah! Foxfire is not a fire fox. I can't pronounce things. I purposely pronounce things wrong and backwards at times. I gave up on trying to fix it. Foxfire, teeny hut. I feel like there's something else that I can't remember right now. Mm, probably. Um, I can't have Joven run too far away. Kiki, go catch up with Conry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Dang, Kiki. What? <laughs> Alright, anyway. Roll perception. No, I don't wanna. Come on, I'm like water. Serenity. Serenity's like Joven. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> you the sling. Conry's hmm. like, I see it all. Okay. Conry. I know. Bad things happen when you nat 20 on perception. I know, but <laughs> usually it's Kiki that does that. <laughs> so Danny, how dead are we? Not dead. It's just a simple combat. Danny really wants to get to Kaza because there's more fun there. <laughs> but I wanted y'all to have a combat before we got there. Um, <laughs> look, fellas. Look what we have here. Why does that have the Russian accent? 
He's not. It wasn't Russian, dude. It was just nasally. <laughs> like they are not related to Jacoby. Also, they're, that one was nasally. He's got a sinus infection. <coughs> are you just going to stand here and play with your asses all day? Or are you going to go get us some gold? <laughs> sure thing, boss. <laughs> no, Russian. <laughs> Trouble ahead. No one told Kamana. No! Connery just said! Trouble ahead. <laughs> I don't care. What's Kamana's AC? 16. Maybe. That doesn't hit. This arrow is buzzing by your hair, Kamana. Do you notice them? I would hope so. Do I need to roll perception again? Yes, he does. Oh, look! There they are. Hmm. Good, some fun. Stop where you are. Give us all your gold! Where the fuck are your guys' voices <laughs> coming from? Every... <sighs> Every bad thing. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. Dope. All your initiatives. Okay. Um. Maybe. Hmm. They're not going on the thingy. Connery, why did you roll twice? He has lightning reflexes. Okay. Here. Turn all, you gotta turn all this into tracker in the... The, uh... I'm just card. gonna roll him one more time so I can get him on the card. Well, if I can change him on his, his first roll. It's not letting me change it! Hold on, what was his first roll? S... Uh, Seven, and now it's refreshing. and now it's refreshing the page. So give me a minute. Okay. Oh, Serenity, pet. Plain, you didn't change her card before you rolled her. What do you mean? Oh, now it's there. Uh, my my computer slow. Remember this. It does not live for you people. It only lives to torment me. Yes. What? Why are you on there properly? Huh. Kiels, why do you roll good initiative? <laughs> why? So that she can make you question why. I am questioning. It's true. Wait. For it to work. <coughs> or not work. What? I selected a token, you stupid... Oh, internet. Please pardon our technical difficulties. Yeah. Oh, we've warned you about this before. Clean. All of that's coming through. Of course you'd roll good. Yep. He wants to kill things. Mm -hmm. It'll be okay, Joven. 
I love how you knew that was Joe Penguin. You can just hang back there and heal people if you want to. You don't have to fight. No. Roll a 16. He wants to fight. More than serenity. He wants to fight as much as Kiki does. <laughs> Yay! Ishness. Let's see if I inputted this properly and try to do it. <laughs> No, stop trying to grab him. If it's trying to reroll Kaimana's initiative, I don't mind. to restart the API on roll 20. Ah, okay. <laughs> Simple solution, Danny. Yep. Once my internet allowed me to find it. Oh, good lord. Oh, you're first. <laughs> Which one is you? <clears throat> Alright. You're gonna move up. Kaimana. It would just be a lot easier on you if you just hand over the fucking gold. Now he's going to attack you. Mm -hmm. Ooh. What, Danny? Nothing. I'm rolling the attacks once my computer let me. What was his AC again? 16. Five slashing? Alright. It only hit once. Okay. <laughs> yes, I know you're going to have fun with this. Then it's your turn. You're gonna come down to this little dude. You're going to wish you hadn't tried to steal from me. <coughs> Pulls out his sword. Swings it through the air. Do -do -do. Misses. Oh, that hit 15. <laughs> of damage. <laughs> eh, he has a pretty sword. <laughs> Not to mention he took um, my background that gives him the five necrotic, necrotic damage. Necrotic, because he's evil. Mm-hmm. Necro damage. <laughs> what? Hi, cat. 
<clears throat> we have a guest appearance by Danny's cat. Me, me, me. Hi. Where'd you wake up from? Because you clearly just woke up by that look on your face. <laughs> She just woke up, everybody. She's, she's questioning why mommy isn't in bed, isn't she? It is not time for mommy to be in bed, cat. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. <coughs> oh, fuck, you're still behind me. You're not going to do that thing where you lay down on my butt behind my back, are you? Maybe. She might be. She's done that before. It's not weird. It's a little weird. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Because Danny thought it'd be fun to roll an individual hit die for see how many hit points this guy had. So is it dead yet? As <laughs> lifts his sword up and just he brings it swapping down it just goes slices the guy right in half like butter it rolled him six hit points he did 15 damage someone's mildly turned on (laughs) (laughs) Connery, it's your turn. Yep. From where... uh, Trying to... Okay, from where he's at... Can he see any of them? That one. Yes. Well, that doesn't hit. That one hits. That's all he can do. Hey, turn your air ammo police off, please. I will do that. <laughs> Poor guy. How many hit points did he have? Dude, I'm going to go try to attack Zane. Good luck with that. Hey, what else the fuck you think you're doing? You can't just treat us like that. Did you, oh, you actually hit. Uh-oh, that's not good. Oh, it only took four damage, but you actually hit. He has to double it. check. Now he's probably very angry. Yes, he is. <laughs> very, very angry. <laughs> His fangs descend. <laughs> You okay, Becca? I'm good. The vampires. I'm not turned on. I mean, Kaimon is not turned on. <laughs> oh, Hi. Becca. Yes. It's totally <laughs> Kaimana and not me. Alright, now this is the guy that Connery shot at. He's going to shoot right back at Connery. <laughs> You shoot him, he shoot you. That's how this works. What's Connery's AC? His AC is 18. Oh, shit, that definitely hit. Oh, that's not the right weapon. <laughs> <laughs> well, eight points of piercing damage. 
and then he broke it. <laughs> that works. Connor has six hit points right now. Okay, that bandit has one. <laughs> Have for fuck's sake, you idiots. Where did you get these guys again? The town! Where else? We're never recruiting from Kaza, Kaza again. Why do you sound slightly drunk? <laughs> you might be. <laughs> well, you gotta be drunk to try to hit uh, Zane. Yeah. You missed all of your attacks. You are drunk. <laughs> I think this is the dead guy. Uh, is this the dead guy? No, the dead guy's after Jovan. Okay, so this is that guy who's going to <coughs> come up here and attack Kaimana. I know. Hey, Kaimana! That's what I get for being in front. What's your AC? 16. That hit! Seven points of slashing damage. I am still alive at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> Please last until my turn. <laughs> Keyleth. Yes. It's your turn. Oh, you sounded like you were actually speaking in Harold voice. Sorry. No. <laughs> Like, yes, Dad? Kill. <laughs> I will try. What? That's the one next to, Con to not Conry, um, Kaimana. A con save? Yeah. Mm hmm. Roses con, 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 roses con. And you're going to learn why Danny plays a lot of bards. And it's 15 for the DC. I don't know why I'm saying 12. Well, he still failed. Okay. <laughs> Okay, he's still alive. Yep. I will fix that in a minute. <laughs> Who are you healing? That was to Kaimana, who had three hit points. Aww, that's so nice of you, Kiki. <laughs> when, you know, the cleric is right behind you. It's still her turn. Okay, done. The healing word was bonus action. You're gonna do that again, okay. Oh. Wait, oh, it made it. Okay. It rolled a 16. Okay. You said your DC was 15, right? But he does, uh, he, because the first one did, he does have a disadvantage on his first weapon attack. <sighs> Jogan can heal Conry. <laughs> Who I think is also low. Well, <laughs> he's going to run over here and on his little gnomey legs. 
as far as he can run. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, you can move one more. 5, 10, 15, 20, 20, 25, yes. <laughs> Hide in the tree. He is going to... Why do you not have that spell? Why did you not take that one? You've got to be different. I know. Oh, it actually worked. He's going to use Hand of Radiance. Cool. Um, on this dude. I just realized I was rolling the wrong card's con save. For some odd reason, I thought you were attacking the bandit, and you were attacking the bandit captain. Oops. Okay, yeah, you definitely took damage on that one. You rolled a three to his... No, he has one hit point. No, come back. You're not dead. Get back here. You have one hit point. <laughs> no one would freak if he killed you. Uh, then he's going to throw a healing word at Conry. <laughs> My baby. All right. What is it? Nine points. Oh, that's too much. Yeah, you don't have to take all of the points. He can be a bit of an overzealous healer. <laughs> Considering he natted on it. <laughs> <sighs> oh, crap. I forgot. I had to fix certain of these healing spells, too. Why? Because she's a life domain clerk. Hi, Mana. Your turn. Okay. Oh, I think I might have already done that. That one. <clears throat> okay, well, the rapier hits. Yep. Still alive? Yeah, it's a... Yeah. Okay, just checking. Remember, those have more hit points. Do it again. Okay, one of those hit as well. I can't hit with my short sword, apparently. That's why daggers are better, Kaimana. I haven't met you yet, I don't know that. <laughs> anyway, um, Serenity! Yep! Choo, choo, it's your turn. My baby. She's moving up there. Um. This one. A deck save? Yeah. <laughs> no, if you're going to annoy me, I'm going to. Oh, yeah. Oh, definitely made it. Roll to 17. I'm going to check her. Her, her DC is not above 17. It's going to be 15 at the most. Yeah, I'm just checking for my own sake of mine. 
Eight, two, seven, eight. Yeah. Celine, what's your wisdom? 19 right now. Then it's then you're 14. Yeah. Because Kiki's <laughs> is 20 and hers is 15, so. Hi, Mana. Hi. You're lucky he's at disadvantage. Was it a screen crit? No. But it would have hit. Now for the rest of that attack. No thanks. I'm good. <laughs> That's a green crit. Fuck. He's unconscious. I'm just going to assume he's unconscious. Well, how many hit points does he have? Nine. No, no total. Fifteen. Did you just kill Kaimana? <laughs> you? Maybe? Nevin? No, I gotta, Nevin, me. rebel. Let me, let me, um, math real quick. Let me math on the other calculator real quick. <laughs> Nevin, rebel. Don't let him die before he meets you. Okay, so you said he had 15, so he had 9. Okay, so... No, come on, clear. Not 15,000. 24 is the magic number, Danny. You killed Kaimana. No! I gotta subtract the 9. Right? Okay. I might have killed Kaimana. <laughs> Danny! See, I was expecting a character to die. I was actually expecting it to be Hela. Because she actually has a lower AC. <laughs> Danny. Hi. Is Nevin screaming at you? Hi. <laughs> I gotta see something. Send some jewels over to visit. <laughs> so, no, we're good. Danny's trying Send to... Send to David over as well. Danny's trying it's to read him. Let's get back to life, you idiots. <laughs> we're rebelling. <laughs> we're rebelling his death. <laughs> well, um, you keep it up and some little thing that can fix you is not going to. You are dead. I know. You dead. Um. I okay. Know, I don't want to be dead. Fans <laughs> <laughs> turn. You want him to be dead. He's dead. <laughs> I don't okay. think she likes looking at the X on Kaimana. <laughs> It reminds her of what she did. Would you hit with the vorpal? <coughs> you killed one of them. Be happy about that. Yeah, you bit his throat out. I know. <laughs> the guy who was stabbing at him, he just reaches out and goes. <sighs> Cat's like, what the fuck? And then the other guy, he just kind of stabs in the gullet and pulls his sword back out. Come on, Skype, quit trying to die. Connery, your turn. Yep. That does not hit Connery. That really doesn't hit. He's yep. shaken up because one of their party members died. Okay. That's... Hmm. 
<laughs> Try with disadvantage. Yeah, you're not gonna hit her. You realize that, right? Okay. <laughs> you're gonna continue to try to attack Zayn. You are not smart, are you? <laughs> There's no fear. The True. guy who just stabbed you in the gullet, and you're gonna try to hit him. Sure. Good luck with that. So far, he's literally missed all of... Oh, look, there he hit once. Twice. Shit. Fuck, damn. Okay, that missed. Nine more points of damage, Zan. Yeah, you're not happy. So... Now, if I can get the turn order to cooperate. This bandit. Okay. Oh, you're gonna go up here. Hi, Connery. Stabbed. What's your AC? It is 18. Okay, good. You're good. Kiki, your turn. Yep. Just a second. Okay. I gotta fix something. Uh, shit. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Using her bonus action to cast Shillelagh. Okay. And then she's going to attack the thing that just attacked Conry. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that's all. Oh, you're a spell sniper. You think? Maybe. Let me check. Nope. Never mind. Oh, but you... Why didn't you tell me this sooner? What? He took mobile as a feat. He doesn't move 25 feet. He moves 35 feet. <laughs> Hi. He just killed something. She's not sure how to react to that. Good job, Keila. That wasn't Dad, by the way. That was somebody else who can get into your head very easily. Neil? Yeah! Fuck off. You love me and you know it. 5, 10, 15, 20. 25, 30, you can run to this side of him. <laughs> Gentle repose. No. Shit, which ones do you have? Oh, yay! You actually got there. That's why I was wondering. Oh, touches him. Revivify. We am alive. <laughs> I forget if that actually gives me hit points or not. One hit point. <laughs> <laughs> One hit point. I'm alive. Man, am I glad I put him at that level? <laughs> I'm glad. Nine. This is how good a healing word Joven is. Nine more hit points. Mm. Yay! <laughs> and apparently, I was really paranoid about killing you people. <laughs> <laughs> apparently. <laughs> make the PC good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're right. Mama. Okay, Mama. Well, I'm gonna get up. Be very angry for a second. You cannot rage. <laughs> I can certainly try. <laughs> that it. That didn't. It. Um. He's still alive. Damn it. Now it's Serenity's turn. Yes. Yes, it is. 
And yes, when Jovan went running over to Kaimana, that dude that's in between them, he ran up a little bit and went. <laughs> the guy in front of her. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. That's the one Jovan, or somebody hurt. He has one hit point. He's dead. Stop trying to shoot him. Well, then the other one goes to the next closest enemy Don't that she can try see. Don't try to kill the thing that Zan's working on. I don't. Think okay, she, yes, that's it. I don't think she can see the one next to Kaimana. Yeah, no. because he got back up, which is great because it's next. <laughs> it is, isn't it? Yeah, wonderful. <laughs> Hi. Is Kamana still pretty bad off? He's got ten hit points. It's, not your, turn anymore. <clears throat> it's huh? not your turn anymore. She still had a bonus action. It's not your turn anymore. I already started rolling. What's Kamana's AC? Sixteen. Danny. Man, am I glad. Joven's right next to you. What did you do? Knocked him back out. How many hit points does he currently have? Ten. Did you just kill him again? <laughs> Nevin, now rebel. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on, Danny? Where? Joven can cast her the five, three times. That's nice. Doesn't mean he needs to every single day. Let's not make it necessary. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, it did. 21 points of damage. He's back out. Yeah, I'm out. I'm not dead this time, though. Swish! Spares the dying. Yep. He's right there. <laughs> yep. Yes. Kill the thing in front of you. Kill it. Okay. Or, you know, don't hit it all. Okay, bite it. He just wants to bite things, doesn't he? Mm-hmm. Okay. <laughs> All right. Anyway, Henry. <coughs> yep. Do something useful. Hey, that hit. Well, it's still alive, but hey, that hit. You're dead. You're gonna you're, try to. <laughs> you're gonna be stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Fear, the lack of fear made people stupid. That's what Danny's That's whole what, thing is. <laughs> yep. <laughs> fear, without fear, people are stupid. <laughs> <laughs> this is the... attack the guy who literally just ripped a chunk of flesh off of your body. You're going to attack him pretty damn well, too. Fuck. He's still alive, but he took 37 points of damage. Holy fuck. He hit almost every single hit. <laughs> yeah, you're not happy. You can't rage either. You're not a barbarian. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, make me one. <laughs> Everybody gets a free rage when they get knocked out. Or almost knocked out. <laughs> now, he's still pretty decent. Not actually decent is not the right word. That missed. I know. 
Okay. Mm. Okay, Kelvin. Eight points to Kaimana. Many, Kamana. Eight, not nine. I, I can type <laughs> sometimes. Um, then <coughs> since you're still down, he's gonna shoot with his crossbow. He's gonna miss because he never uses his weapons. Um, <laughs> oops. And then. That's what he's gonna do. Okay. He's saving his other first level spell in case you go down again. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Mona! Yep. You gonna get up? I'm thinking about it. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to heal myself a little bit. I think that's a bonus. Yeah, that's a bonus action. So then I'm going to attack this asshole. Hey, I finally hit with my sword sword. Uh -huh, I'm still alive. I know. That's all I can Threatening. do. That's all I can do. Yeah. <coughs> Whack. <laughs> Did she kill it? Literally everybody Stop. had to try. <laughs> Apparently I'm not even going to move the turn order because that means that that guy's dead and then it's Zayn's turn. Yep. yep. And Zayn always tends to hit with this. Let's see. Yeah, okay, it's dead. Sure, he he's ripped his throat like... out with his teeth. Oh. Sorry, had a fandom moment. Um... So he's got like blood dripping down his face and shit. What's her mace back in it? Kaimana turns around and looks at Joven. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. That's right. Mermaid. Merman. He's my kind of mermaid. Yes. Which means long rest. <laughs> Aquatic rest. Jumps into water, gets a long rest. <laughs> Which, of course, doesn't heal him because it's not connected to his card. Fixes. Okay, so. Oops. So he goes for a swim, comes back, dripping wet. Mm. Anyway, <laughs> we're all good with that, right? Dripping uh -huh. wet, come on, everybody. <laughs> uh huh, uh huh. Hi, David. Hi, Lemon. Hi. I know you're the ones making the commentary. <laughs> <laughs> for the viewers, these are his boyfriends that he hasn't actually met in game yet. We warned you! It'll be fun. <coughs> anyway. 
for some experience points. Yay! Experiences! Does Serenity and Connor have zeros in their... Um, no, but I will fix that. Yeah, it's not going to work unless they do. First yeah. thing you do is put a zero in your cards for the experience. Alright, done. <coughs> Hold on. I forgot to to attach Zan and Joven to people so that they would get experience points. <laughs> that might be helpful. Hush you. Make sure they have zeros. Oh, they have more than zeros. It's fine. Well, yeah, make sure they have numbers. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, remember when I was making you hold up the thing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's okay. what I was doing. Yeah, I remember. I had to try and get this little box in the window. Uh -huh. That was hard. It was not hard. You weren't even here. Yeah, what she said. What do you know? You weren't even here. Was this when I was taking my f midterm? No. 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 This was over the weekend. Danny Museum and... Joven a while back. Danny rolled a d8 to figure out what level they were going to be on. Thank God Joven rolled what he did. <laughs> Come out of very nearly kissed him. You want to talk about freaking the little gnome out? He thought about it. Like, yeah, maybe not. And overprotective clergy sister? Okay. You think you scare me, little girl? If this works. Did it work? Woo! 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 Not enough to level y'all up, though. Nope. Anyway. But still, it's... Dripping wet, Kaiwana. Uh, anyway. He probably hasn't put his shirt back on yet. I got the easy experience to work. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> yes, I know what you're going to do, and Joven's going to think it's bad. He's gonna, Joven's going around, kind of blessing all the bodies for burial. It's what he does, <laughs> and okay. um, Zan's going around shaking them all. You want my money? I'll take yours. Oh my god, he fucking nat twenty, and he has like no intelligence. <laughs> He gets all the money. He's literally just picking the bodies up and shaking them. <laughs> like a bully in a schoolyard. <laughs> Serenity's still a little stunned. She Joe killed does what he does. <laughs> no, she she was the one who got the final blow on one of them. Yeah, that is why Joven just freaking out for a minute there. So <laughs> was Kiki. So she's like, oh. Yeah. Well, your brother was happy with it. Which makes me even less happy with it. Do you have that? I'll be glad when we get to the mountains. She's talking to Connery. Uh, uh, Connery was about to reply. He was like, oh, and why's that? Because my family can't make any more commentary once we get there. Are they being that bad? It's my family. True. Let's see. Neil? Yeah. 
So, by the by, I just realized Jovan has ceremony. He's going to... He's, he's trying to drag the bodies together to have a kind of like a burial ceremony for them. <laughs> Which is funny because Jovan's this little gnome trying to drag dead bodies around. <laughs> Let me go help the little gnome. I think you're gonna be okay. I think she can figure out what you're doing. She's gonna help because she feels really guilty for killing people. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Serenity's gonna very carefully just roll your strength to see if you can move them. Holy fuck, Jovin! Um, <laughs> I got this one. <laughs> Nope, not saying Joven rolled like a fucking 19, but <laughs> Joven kind of rolled a 19. I... Connery, did you take the, 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 this dead body? Okay. Yeah. Serenity is done shaking people. I'm... Serenity's trying to grab this one. There. Um, no. I tried. Um... Waits for computer to roll. Oh, Connery and Serenity able to carry that yes, one. Yes, both of you two together. Joven kind of has this guy because he rolled a fucking 20 in strength. Hey, this is the one that they had cut in half, right? Yeah. I'm going to grab one half. I'm going to carry a whole person. Okay. That, that'll work. <laughs> Takes half the body. Comes back to the <laughs> <laughs> He's going to Sorry. use sacred flame to cleanse the bodies and cast a burial ceremony, a, a, a kind of a cremation ceremony. Since y'all don't have the means to bury them, he's going to do a kind of a creation, uh, cremation ceremony, returning their bodies to the earth and nature of Onkaris to see if he does fit with them. So he he's starts just saying prayers. He starts <laughs> casting the prayer and doing the ceremony. You just see his sacred flame build up and turn this golden <laughs> color. And then it encompasses the dead bodies. And you just see them wisping up into the air, turning into leaves as they blow away. Isn't this kind of a waste of time? Let them do what they want to do for a minute. <sighs> Are we really on that much of a time crunch? No. Just bored. Yeah, Zenian is cleaning off his chin and licking his fingers. Uh-huh. Let's <laughs> you missed a bit right there. <sighs> he just sticks his tongue out and like gets it off his face. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> after they turn into pretty golden leaves and return to the earth, they go bye bye. Joven's done. That's what he apparently uses last first level spell slot for for right now. <sighs> seemed like a thing he'd do. Yep. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Definitely seems like a thing he'd do. All right, now you all are ready to head to Kaza. Keza. Ke- Fucking Danny, remember how to say your own thing. Keza. Keza. Cause, uh, where, where, where did my people go? I moved them. Where I wanted them. They're right there. Near Keyleth. I, I don't see them. That's a Conry. No, I literally don't see them. Let me refresh. Open your eyes. No, we're switching maps. <sighs> I'm refreshing anyway. What head. What Becca said. <coughs> or annoyed. Whatever. This is my disgruntled Becca noise. Note! The disgruntled Becca didn't make that noise when I killed her character twice. I knew you'd fix it. And you only killed him once. Oh. Knocked out her character. The second time, he was four points from death, but he was still technically alive, just unconscious. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, at least it's not me this time. I've been the only one on the receiving end of a Danny death. Uh, do I um, want to remind you about Eve Lena being crushed to death by a chain of returning? Also, the first person who ever died in D&D. Mercy. Oh yeah, I killed Mercy. We brought her back, don't worry. I would have made disgruntled noises if you killed Keyleth. Is Kaimana not worth disgruntled noises? He knew people in your head would rebel and bring him back. He hoped people in my head would rebel and bring him back. Oh, come on, Nevin. You know you want me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> we'll have him together. Huh. I live that long enough. Huh? I live that long. <laughs> <laughs> or if I don't find someone else along the way, I'm trying really hard not to have him flirt with Zayn. <laughs> Becca, just because they have supposed boyfriends or girlfriends or married couples or whatever does not mean they cannot interact with other people along the way. These are not set people. Try I will to flirt. <laughs> I will totally fuck up all of your relationships. The only set relationship right now is uh, Lily and Gray. <laughs> that's the only one that's like gotta happen because otherwise they will be marrying voices. Because Dev and Ezra are already married, they have kids. <laughs> <laughs> so technically, they're the only set couple. Touche. Mm. Good job, Daddy. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> look, we're in Keza now. No, we are. Did I move us? I did. Okay. Oops, I just moved myself <laughs> to the wrong map. <laughs> Ta-da! Welcome to town. There, there we go. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Welcome to Keza. They've never been to this town before. There is. Jovial sounds and music and happy things playing in the air. There's fresh blooming flowers everywhere. It's luscious. It's green. It's beautiful. There seems to be events happening. Sellers, traders. There's massive rolling hills in the background that y'all just came through that had plenty of farmlands and animals and sheep and cows. <laughs> Hi, Becca, what? Danny and cows. Did I mention that they're sheep? They're right here. I'm wearing them. <laughs> but, um... The flowers bloom and seem to be the petals seem to be floating through the air as the music just seems to fall. Looks like there's a fresh glint on the grass at all times, making it oh so beautiful. Kilo the proofs. Roll wisdom save, everyone. Oh fuck. <laughs> All right, Kiki, you're fine. Come on, you're not fine. Yeah, I looked at his wisdom. I was like, one. Yeah, you're fucked. Carney has a zero. <laughs> so, Benedict, you're supposed to be good at wisdom. I know. You have like the fucking Rajani curse. She must be. Rajani being the druid that. Could never wisdom. Could never wisdom and ended up getting kidnapped by the bad guys. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that was fun. Okay, so Serenity and Kailan are the only ones that failed this DC. But that that's a pleasant thought. I'm gonna fail every time. <laughs> <laughs> what? Um one, two, three, four, five. Let's roll for Serenity. Uh oh. Roll 
building. I've got a crush on you. I hope you feel <laughs> Oh god, Danny, what just happened? Serenity, as you enter town and you feel the vibes in the air and you hear the music, you start to notice how cute Kaimana is. <laughs> Wow, that's, and, that's impressive. <laughs> and Kaimana, you know how you were trying not to flirt with Zayn? Out the window. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Welcome to Kessa. <laughs> I got a feeling we're dealing with scary shit. Welcome. Oh, Hi. Hi. <laughs> you okay there, Danny? Uh huh, because I know what's happening. <laughs> Makes me entertained. Uh, Serenity, are you okay? Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> We're gonna take that as a no, she ran away. <laughs> Hi, Danny. <laughs> that was the player getting a Charlie horse. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My fucking calf muscle finally is rebelling <coughs> from everything I put it through this past weekend. <coughs> oh, that hurt. Um, I, I, I'm fine, Joven. I'm <sighs> um, you're, you're not getting sick, are you? No, I'm fine, Jovan. Uh, uh, okay, maybe we, we should find the ta tavern. That sounds like a good idea. Yeah. T to the tavern. Yep. Uh, serenity. Roll a... Religion check to see if you know whose temple is here. I gotta wait for Selene to get back to her computer. Oh, yeah. Pity all the blood's gone. Yeah, I know. It's very sustaining. I just thought you looked good covered in blood. <laughs> I look good in anything I wear. That's true. So I'm get back here. I want you to look this. I'm here. A religion. <laughs> okay. There's a uh, Soraset temple here. Just in case you ever need to know. It's Soraset's temple. This is a Soraset storage room. Oh, I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I found them when I was searching for shit to put on the map. I was like, I want both. <laughs> You're okay near Soraset temple. She is in the hollowed Parthenon. Pantheon. Fucking words. <laughs> She's in the hollowed group. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. <coughs> Becca, do you still have um, my obsidian portal on? Yep. Open. What is she, the goddess of? Uh, the goddess of sailors, the guiding beacon. Oh, never mind. Let's not put her here. What? <laughs> Read me the. Raimi, Moros, Morcia, and Armino. Armino. Uh, the Diva of Trix, Goddess of Lost Years, 
Uh, he who wins without shame. God of slyness and vengeance. Okay, now, um... <laughs> Trying to figure out who should be here. Uh, Labria. Read me Labria. Nature's mind, goddess of the woods. Yeah, it'll work. That's Keyleth's god. Yep, okay, so there's a temple of Labria here. Keyleth, you can roll religion too to see if you know that there's one here. There's a temple. There's a temple. I don't know what's too, but there's a temple. I move really badly around temples. Have you noticed? <laughs> <laughs> it would make sense for it to be a nature god. All the green. Shut up, you. <laughs> Go fawn over Kaimata. <laughs> anyway, you're all making your way towards the tavern. How how bad is she fawning? Oh, you're fawning. You're probably kind of sort of fangirling over him. Internally, she is. No, dude, you didn't pass. <laughs> Some people fangirl inside their heads. Who are these people and where do they live? I want to know their secrets of life. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to quietly fangirl. How do you... <coughs> how do you quietly... What? I don't know. Squeak! Anyway... As you all walk past some of the citizens, roll perception on them. <laughs> now you roll well, Kaimana. <laughs> yep. <laughs> well, Kaimana and Connery, Joven and Zan. You all notice that they all seem to be humming a happy ditty, seem to be swaying around, some of them seem to be writing. Um, you ever hear one of them going, my love, you are my love, will you marry me? And there's nobody there, they're just practicing a proposal. <laughs> and they have this beautiful ring. With a very lovely engraved pearl set in the ring. Because I do believe Keza is along a river. Or near a river. We passed a river coming in. Uh, okay. the, the bandits. Keza is located on one side of a low level mountain, on the, in between a river, mountain, and then more green grass. So. If they go over the map, yeah, okay, they can get pearls. <laughs> Had to logic. Yeah. Danny does it sometimes. Other times, I just want this to happen the way I want it to happen. I love you, Danny. I'm glad I'm not making the pearls be the ones singing. You are the luckiest girl in the land because we've got a beautiful wedding friend. <laughs> Random Ted Kingdom moment. I'm okay now. <laughs> I'm so confused. You have not seen the Ten Kingdom. No. It is downstairs, Celine. I will go and get it. You, need you to will leave. have to bring it. You will have to bring it when we have... You need to we'll leave. have to bring it next weekend. <laughs> it's really long. <laughs> it's four part, four or five parts. Five parts. Okay. Singing rings. Anyway, they're not singing. The people <laughs> are. Anyway. <laughs> 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 Zayn just kind of looks at the guy like he's insane and keeps walking towards the tavern. <laughs> so, 
Serenity. Get up there. <laughs> Strange people here. Yeah. There seems to be. Letting Joven stay next to Serenity. <laughs> My computer froze. I couldn't wait <laughs> to figure out where he went. As you keep walking along, you literally notice that all of the festival tents have, like, wedding garnishments. There's, like, sewers with dresses and wreaths of flowers and veils and t- nice sh- fabric for men's suits for this time period. Um, a armor polisher. <laughs> Someone to help you write. Because not everyone in the village knows how to write. (laughs) Roll perception on the guy outside the temple. Oh, come on. (laughs) Nope. Nope. Neither of my characters can see it. (laughs) You notice him hanging a sign that says, All weddings postponed until both parties agree to wed. (laughs) Do not bring in your (laughs) significant other without full consent. (laughs) That's very strange. (laughs) I wouldn't think you'd need a sign for that. You can't tell where you're heading. You're going to the big building. Over here. Mm-hmm. Tavern's over here. Are you, or are you just in character? No, I'm... None of my characters are overly in love. I meant to put you on the board first. I hope I have you copied. I don't think I've copied and pasted anything else since then. Nope, there you are. (laughs) The tavern! Thank you, Pinterest, for the tavern map. Whoever made it, you're (laughs) awesome. (laughs) Anyway, enter the tavern! Come on, computer. Everybody roll perception just for the hell of it. Let's see. <laughs> he looks like, I want to see. I don't, but <laughs> I'm pretty sure you were starting to say Keyleth, so I figure I probably should. Yeah. Come on, why do you roll good on wisdom except the one time you need to? I don't know. Hey, Keyleth! <laughs> uh-huh. Yep. I know you. <laughs> you do know him. He's from home. Oh, fuck. What's wrong? Points over in the corner. Keyleth, Look. you know it's Benedict. Yeah. The home follows. Always. Bad enough that they're in my head. 
That'll be okay. Let's go sit. No serenity. I'm not gonna let Joven sit next to the vampire. Oh, but you failed. Why don't you keep him company, Kayla? Because <laughs> we're too close to Ben and Night. We're going to he could find without somebody nearby. <laughs> uh, hi. Hi. We don't want you getting lost. How, how, how can I get lost in a tavern? Well... It would be hard for us to see if somebody tried to take you. Who who, who, who would what be? I'm just saying. We don't know what's going on in this town. And apparently, your sister is having something happen. Connery's being smart because Serenity's been very protective of him until they got here. <laughs> He's logic. Mm -mm. Just, just, just try to make sure the party works well together. All right. Hi, Keila. Oh, Benedict. Keza, huh? What are you doing here? Well, I'm enjoying a fine meal, of course. Do you want something? I'm fine. Are you certain? Percival would have my hide if I didn't at least offer to give you some sustenance. Fine, then. <laughs> what will you have? I don't mind. What's good? Just orders or something. <laughs> He gets served it. Your Percival is incredibly worried about you. He was welcome to come with me. He chose not to. That doesn't mean he doesn't worry. Is that why you're here? I'm here because Alyssa's worried. I'm fine. She was not given the option to go with you. And we know how persistent our dear little Illy can be. Indeed. She's worried about her best friend. So I'll be home soon. I certainly hope so. Though, I do think it'd be rather fun to see Percival in this town. What do you mean? Haven't you noticed? 
all the strange things. Everyone just seems very happy. They're beyond happy, Keyleth. They're in love. Every single person in this town is in love with someone. And who are you in love with? Oh, no one. (laughs) But not every person. I'm an exception to the rule. We know this by now. (laughs) Or it just hasn't affected me yet. The things I do to appease Illy. The things I do to appease my father. (laughs) I think mine's less threatening. Probably. Most days. (laughs) I see you picked up some companions along the way yeah don't particularly care for them not really Uh, okay Caleb's not a people person. Caleb. Also, the gnome runs away from her constantly. She's not interested in getting the nose in. <laughs> yes, Conway? Good news from home, hopefully. Hello, Conry. Hello, Benedict. Billy's just worried. We couldn't have... We can't let everyone face danger all at once. Still think Neil would have been better suited to this mission? Oh no. Possibly. Oh, sweetie. Neil's doing something else for your father. Doesn't he always? Of course. Because he's, what does Harold call him? The good son. Uh huh. Those were his words, weren't they? Mm-hmm. Don't worry, Keyleth. I still think he knows you're a girl. <laughs> I suppose I should offer to get you some food, too, Conry. Would you like something? Sure. I... Do Just get somebody got Keyleth. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably fine. I'm not counting the NPCs in the room to have them roll wisdom saves. Nope. Yes, you are. I might be. <laughs> Dear God, help us all. <laughs> <laughs> made it, failed, made it, failed, made it, made it, made it. Okay, two failed. <coughs> okay, cool. Okay. Now there's one, two, three, four, five, eight, nine, ten, eleven. to see who's falling in love with him. <laughs> How's Lucian? And my sisters. Mm. 
They're fine. Kenna's a little anxious. Something happened? You're not there. She doesn't even like me, but would she care? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that was in response to what I said or what you rolled. <laughs> What she rolled, probably. <laughs> oh god, I'm scared. <laughs> you guys can't so, see the look on her face, but it's kind of scary looking. <laughs> are you trying to tell me I have a scary face? I mean... When you're really excited about things, sometimes. <laughs> Hi, Annie. Hey there, handsome. Connery? Uh huh. Hi. <laughs> um, hello. <coughs> My next song's gonna be for you. And she reaches her finger out and drags it down his chest. Oh. And she okay. winks at him. <laughs> She's the performer. Yeah, it just Connery's just like the what? <laughs> <laughs> He's just confused. Yes, yeah, so she's going to do a very flirtatious, very sensual performance directed directly at Connery. And this person on the other side of the stage is kind of like. What's happening over here? <laughs> Very good. And then this guy. Hello, boys. Welcome to Casa. What can I do you for? Specifically directed at Kaimana. <laughs> Kaimana, you're popular. <laughs> I'm good, thanks. Yes, sir. Because you look like you're a little thirsty. Would y'all lock around the drinks? He looks to his companions. I never turned down the drink. All right, then. Just water. Yes. Water, sweetheart. No, no. With all the festivities and happiness here in this town, water is a thing you don't get. Oh. You're gonna drink, little miss. Oh. Goes up, orders drinks, and brings back drinks for the table. <laughs> I think I'm <laughs> Somebody's competing with you for Kaimana's attention. Are you really going to let him out, do you? No. No, you're not. I don't know what to have her do. She's never flirted or anything. It's weird. <laughs> for any flirting is weird. Kaimana flirting with not Bevan and David is weird, but he's doing it. But you have somewhere to come from. Sir, he's never flirted. <laughs> that is not true. When? <laughs> I bet if he had a fluffy tail, she'd flirt. No. <laughs> She has not flirted. Towards the end, you flirted. Don't you even try that serenity. I have never flirted. <laughs> I distinctly remember flirting. 
<laughs> I don't remember any kind of flirting. Ivor just has a very distinctive, unique way of flirting. Stealing? Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I noticed Kiki moved closer to Benedict. She's just sitting down, enjoying her meal. Not the people from home. He's one of the ones you probably could tolerate stalking you more than others. Yeah. I mean, he was probably hanging around her Nilly a lot. Mm hmm. <coughs> Considering he's the. He is what Connery is to Kiki is to Benedict is to Illy. Yeah. Except he never falls in love with Illy. <laughs> How long are you planning on following me? I don't know. I'll probably head back after this town. Alright. But... Hmm. Something bothers me here. I mean, come on. Look. She's practically in Connery's lap. Um. Who hits on Connery like that? Courtney's probably trying to push her back to the stage. I'm sure people have different types. Apparently he's found his. Courtney just looks at her. No. Jealous. Why would I be jealous of Connery? Maybe you're jealous of the girl. Just missing Percy. Hmm. When you go back, tell him there's still room down here for him. Hmm? When you go back, tell him there's still a spot for him. Mm, to join you? Always. Mm. I'll let him know. Connery's not the greatest bodyguard in the world. Well, I could have told you that. Doesn't back chat enough. I heard that. <laughs> Good. Maybe now you'll do something. Connor, you know Benedict's one that's never shied away from his opinions. And usually his opinions... Pretty accurate. <laughs> Connery doesn't talk back to people that threaten Kiki enough if he's supposed to be the bodyguard. <laughs> As we've well witnessed. <laughs> so what? No perception. Fuck. I was gonna ask him. Everybody? Mm-hmm. Okay. Connor can't see shit. Kayla right now. sees everything, almost. I want to say it. <laughs> also, people want me to drink. Oh, Serenity! Yeah, he's somebody in that 20. She's so happy. Post <laughs> <laughs> what, huh? <laughs> Somebody nat 20. Somebody's very happy. <laughs> I'm not sure I like this. Oh, Hi, Ginger. <laughs> Hi, Becca. Hi. <laughs> How are you? Is she talking to Joven? <laughs> no, she was talking to Becca. Oh. Back it? Back it is? Huh? <laughs> I know. Oh, there's no more. She's the only person hiding on the GM layer that somebody needed in that 24. <laughs> so, Becca, 
Can you guess who that immune person is now? Uh, Ginger? (laughs) (laughs) I'm not sure if it's because she's a genie or because of her general parentage, but Ginger... She just like popped in out of nowhere. Mm-hmm. Has to get to the right layer so I can make him run away. Cause pretty girl. <laughs> I don't know where he ended up. <laughs> um, where he definitely does not want to be. <laughs> <laughs> He's hiding in the doorway now. Uh huh. Um. Trinity, you also noticed Joven running away. Kiki, you notice a little fairy sitting on the bar. Okay. She looks to be thinking really hard and contemplating. And she's staring down people really hard. Tell who she's currently staring at. Anybody who's currently acting like they want to <coughs> love up somebody. Hey, Benedict. Hmm. You see that? <coughs> huh? He says she's been there all night. Also, Serenity, you notice somebody who actually does not look happy or loved up. She looks actually kind of heartbroken. He's <coughs> right. I have to insight check her, don't I? To be able to see if she will actually leave the table and. <coughs> that a high enough insight? Well, you can still see Kaimana from where you're going, so... You're okay with that. <laughs> Hello. Are you okay? Oh. Hi. Hi. I'll be okay. <coughs> What's upset you? Nothing. It doesn't matter. Nothing matters. If you're this upset, it matters. You caught the attention of the guy across the table. He's looking at you. Please leave my sister alone. She does not need to be bothered at the moment. I just wanted to make sure she was okay. Leave her. Serenity, what are you going to do? You want to help her, but you don't really have... You want to help, but you don't know how. Also, come on. Yeah? That was me just telling Serenity. That's also where her mind's going. Oh, yes. What is Kaimana doing? (laughs) Flirting. Lots of things. (laughs) Kind of. Everything will be okay. (coughs) 
And then goes back to the table. She doesn't have... I hate it when she gets... When my characters get wrapped up in this stuff. Because <laughs> it's... So... Out of norm for some of them. <coughs> That's what makes it more fun to do. <laughs> Celine's panicking face when it happens to them is hilarious. <laughs> I'm just like, okay, let's do it. Let's have sex with everyone. No, Becca. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <Yeah>. Anyway. <laughs> Okay, I'm not dying. Good. <laughs> Just trying to remember how to breathe. In and out, in and out. Faster, faster. No. <laughs> Wrong kind of in and out, Danny. Um, Danny, are you teaching me to breathe or do something else? <laughs> well, something else requires breathing. You can't really <laughs> do it with a dead person. Well, I don't know. You can, yeah. but there's a name for that. That's against the law. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> So. Yep. So yeah, this is going to be awkward. Mhm. Did I mention as night settles, you start to feel like your heart is breaking? Aww. Also, no. No, you didn't. Anyone who failed their wisdom save and started to fall in love with somebody, the more the sun sets, the more you feel like you should distance yourself from this person and you want to cry and your heart is going to break. You feel rejected. You feel dismayed. You wish to leave their presence because it feels like they've rejected you just by mere sight. <laughs> Goes to her brother. Are you okay, Pekka? I'm trying to breathe, okay? I'm not doing very well at it. <laughs> It'd probably be best for the party to retire for the night at the moment. Yeah. Because as you retire for the night, roll perception for hearing, for sound. You two can go in here. Come on, card. We should probably turn in for the night. As you lay down, you can hear wailing throughout the town. People crying and... Uh, 
Uh-huh. And you can also hear fighting. How dare you betray me? How dare you say you love another? And then you hear clankings of swords and then more crying and that's pretty much what happens throughout the night until everybody in town passes out. Or dies. Uh, that's a pleasant I thought. Not smile like, I should not smile like that it dies. Should I? You shouldn't, but no. <laughs> But this is you, Danny. <laughs> you have a lot of darkness in your head. I love it. Yes, Connery has... <coughs> oh. What, Celine? Connery is tell, uh, saying to Keila that they should probably retire for the night. Yes, and she agreed. Okay. I think this is supposed to be their room. Mm-hmm. Over here. Mm-hmm. Keyleth, why are you sleeping on the table? <laughs> I don't know. Because <laughs> I can't function. <laughs> there you go, Keyleth. On a bed. <laughs> Halfway on a bed. That'll work. Shut up. You go to sleep upstairs. Go. I'm not moving people around from the morning. Yes, you are. Yes, I am. <coughs> no, you don't like other people. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Excuse me. No, not on the bar. You were not a bar dancer. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Uh, fairly. <laughs> anyway. Money. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe we should stop because Danny's kind of tired. It is 11. Yeah. Okay. Okay. We'll pick this up eventually. Yay, Curse Town. 